They're used to the straight ones, but not the loop. But you know what Murata's not used to? is somebody stepping on his foot and not allowing him to step back and get out of range. Yeah, I'm, I'm looking right now. I, you know, I'm going to have to definitely reassess Murata. Uh, his last fight, he looks spectacular. This fight, he looks okay. He looks average, about average. Nothing, nothing special. Mm, how about that? That was a nice body shot from Murata. Put together, put together well. He's piecing his combinations together extremely well, but... You know, his head. Oh, there it is. That's a left uppercut. Ooh. And down goes Centeno. He heavy hands. What you talk about, Tim? He got some heavy hands, my goodness. And you don't want to upset Murata. Oh. There's a nice right hand from Centeno that catches Murata coming in. He got a little bit lackadaisical, and he almost paid the price. But here comes Murata with the onslaught. There's that straight left. Body work for Murata. Oh, what a way to catch him in the center of the ring. But he did not <laughs> like what you said, Tim. There's that body shot from Subaru Murata. Oh, that's a right to the body. And you see how Centeno's digging deep, just trying to stay on his feet. But his right hand is still dangerous here in round number two. Love it. Look at this offense from both these guys, these gentlemen tonight. Look at that short left hmm. uppercut. It's just well placed. He never saw it coming. It wasn't hard. He didn't dig underneath. You know, just a nice short shot right underneath, right on the chin. You see the reaction right there from Centeno. Beautiful shot. You know, usually when, do, when when guys do happy feet like that, it's normally when they get caught on the temple. Normally when they, he caught him on the chin hmm. and he gave him happy feet on the chin. That's power. I mean, he made him dance a little bit of salsa there. Yeah. There's that jab that sets everything up for Murata. See, he was just playing. He was just playing the first two rounds. Well, Centeno's not playing. No, Centeno looking for the home run, and Murata got to be careful. Because, again, I always tell you folks at home, somebody that's hurt is deadly because mm -hmm. they're fighting for their life. How much punishment he's dishing out, there's going to be something coming back. But man, that right under the armpit. Oh, goodness. Yes. He says he cannot continue. He can't breathe. He's tired. Okay. The fight is over. And thank goodness that man. referee Raul Caiz Jr. listened to the fighter because yes. the cornerman was going to send him out. Oh, man, I was about to throw a pin at his cornerman. Catching his breath. That's why he said he couldn't continue. It was all of the body work. That's, that's what it was. It was accumulation from the body work. All the damage that he took throughout the course of those last two rounds was no joke. And he's buzzed a couple of times throughout the fight as well. That shot right there, splitting the guard. Mm. You see him heavy over his front foot, Centeno is. Gets clipped with that shot. And you see Murata, he comes forward, but he didn't notice it quick enough. He says he 